what is going on guys today we are playing for tale um I'm, I'm i'm busy setting it up because i have some problems recording this like beginning the game and i don't i don't know if i'm going to read all this i'm here fixing things and all that uh yeah y'all can read it i'm going to be busy I can only play on this small screen. Why? Why is that? Okay. Anyway, what was the noise? Was oh, oh. Okay, this is going to be a problem. I hear no noise, no nothing. Y'all probably hear something right now. Oh, there we go. I couldn't hear it. Now I do, and I don't like the music. Okay, here we go. She passed a law under which all fallen humans were considered their friends. I don't know what the story is about right now. Monsters displeased decided to overthrow the queen, which is Toyel, the mighty Undyne. Ex-leader of the royal guard has retaken the throne. What happened to Asgore? Did he, did he die? She, she passed a new law under which all fallen humans must be killed. I, I, I missed the whole story because I was fixing the game. Okay, here we go. So yeah, this is called Horror Tale, Chapter 1. I don't know if there's a Chapter 2, but I found Chapter 1. I'm gonna fix my screen. I'm messing it up. Okay, here we go. Oh, here we go. Many years ago, un another fallen human down to the underground. Monsters believe that Frisk would be the one to set them free. But. The human deprived monsters from this possibility. They had to fight the king of monsters. Asgore Dreamer. In the end, the humans was victorious. Okay, that, that's why. Um, They took away his soul. Oh, that's kind of sad. And left the underground, uh, shits. Sometime after that, the queen. Okay, there we go. We gain, we gain her throne, which is Toyo. She passed another what? A under a law, which all humans were considered. Okay, so we read this already, but we're, we're gonna see see you again. Yep, 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 the mighty undying, ex leader of the royal guard has been retaking the throne. Because she's most powerful than Toyo. Um, that's what I think. And there we go. Just to let y'all know, I'm playing on the small ass screen. Y'all watching it on a big screen because I sized it for y'all. And I'm playing this on a small screen. The name of the hu fallen human is Al Ally Ally Ally. A ray of light cutting through the cracks somewhere upon made your you open your eyes. High enough, like in the sky high, because you've been smoking that crack. Memories of the fall fall of the fall witch. It seems it lasted forever, start to flash in your mind. So this is like after, after um the game, I think. I don't know. Yeah, space, enter. Oh, there we go. Right, you fell. You dropped over one thousand feet. Yet yeah, by some miracle, you are alive. It seems these flowers soften your fall. And this disgusting puddle of mud. Where are you? I don't know. I'm in, in a dark place. The underground, I guess. Darkness surrounds you. Moving my mic as far away as from me as possible. Making it different to see past the circle of poppies. 
At least they are alive, just like you are. When do I get to move? You decided to get up to explore this place. Oh, howdy. No, wait. Oh, that's... That's flowy? What? Why? One eyeball looking at cy Cyclops? Please, be quiet. Don't scream. Like no one's here but me and you. Look, there's nothing I can do to hurt you. Sure. I don't like the music. Howdy! How unexpected! Bitch, you've been waiting there? What do you mean? Another human? Who fell down here by mistake? What? A surprise! I guess it makes you the clumsy and stupid type. You might you might be right. Not to be mean or nothing. Oh, you, but you were mean. Not uh, flowy, flowy the flower. Not not from Undertale, flowy. You often he offers his leaf like a hand. Should we should we shake shake it shake it? How do I find we shake it? Hee hee. You can consider me your first friend down here. I might seem harmless, but don't be so naive, bitch. Or bastard, if he's a guy. Um, okay, here we go. Seeing as down here, it's eat or be eaten, like killed or be killed. But it's here is eaten, eat or be eaten, okay. Such is the rule of our world. Trying to change things up in this game? In horror, horror tale? Jeez, you look like the saddest human alive. Okay, okay, I didn't mean to scare you, but you did. Well, what's your name? You say your name. Eliza. Hmm, an interesting name. I have never met a kid with such a name. I have. You couldn't help but smile shyly. You know, you look cute when you smile. And now, I'm gonna eat you. Be so kind as to proceed to the next room. That room will be a great place to begin. I will wait for you here. Okay. Can I move? How do I move? Oh, arrows, the arrow keys, nice. Okay, get, get in there. So, you're here. Welcome to the underground. Some time ago, it was a bloss, bl bl bloom, blooming thing, blom, 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 thing. I can't read. A uh, lovely place. But it is all in the past now. We don't have much time. She might be coming. Notice that the word she is in red, like blood. So I'll tell you this much. This place is more dangerous than hell itself. Especially for you, human. All of this because of one psycho queen? Talking about Toriel, but we, but we know Toriel is nice and kind in Undertale. But why, why is it? Okay, there we go. I thought that. Okay. Um. So yeah, in this game, Toriel is psycho murderer. Must be damn her. Hmm. Here, put me in your pocket. Seeing as none of us want to stay here maybe together we can get out of this place what do you think Eliza you agree well well <clears throat> ah is that Toyo oh 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 okay he's dead Flowey? Flowey? Rip. Rip in pieces. Rip in pepperonis. 
We have been fat. Fatness. Who did that? I'm about to die. You're shaking. Your soul is filled with fear and not determination. Oh, Toya's about to eat me. Oh, there we go. My child. I'm about to eat your ass. <laughs> Oh, oh, if you look closely, her eyes are different. Okay, what a horrible creature torturing such such pure, innocent youth. Well, you just killed someone. Oh, oh, please don't cry. Wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. An undertale. Flowey was the son of uh, Toya and Asgore. So, uh, yeah, you just killed, killed your son, uh, Toyo. Did I read that last dialogue? I, I don't know. Don't be scared. You're safe now. The big monster gently wipes off your tears. Ah, that's better. I'm so glad this vile weed hadn't managed to hurt you. Talking about drugs here? Vile weed, there we go. Talk about drugs. It seems she doesn't understand what she has done. Killed, you killed your child. Oh, I forgot to introduce myself. My name is Toya. Now, now it's in red. I mean, in blue, in blue. Her name is in blue. I'm the caretaker of the ruins, which is in red. So, eh, trying to balance it out. Balance it out. I pass through this place every day to see if anyone has fallen down. Poor girl, you don't look too good. You must be very hungry. Let's go. I'll take you to my house and cook something to eat. Okay, here we go. I don't like, I don't like this one bit. The ones menacingly looming over you bring scent of stale wind and uh, uh, oh wow well, that beat okay and that word I don't know how to say oh stop it stop it please your soul is filled with fear and not determination welcome child this place is called the ruins. The ruins are my old place filled with puzzles, ancient nets of traps and keys. Ah, these buttons. There used to be a puzzle, but it's no longer work working because this is after. Um, time has left its mark, but there are a lot of puzzles ahead. You will have to solve them. They, they, however, will be less broken i hope they will manage to brighten your mind mood now go dear adventure shall not wait yeah that that one's broken and the, the was there used to be a button here i think so only the fearless may proceed the rest of the plate is broken off the text is unreadable okay Okay, let me just get ready. Okay, here we go. Unfortunately, fortunately, this puzzle is still working. In order to proceed, you still have to press a few switches. I marked the ones you need to need for you. Press Z to read signs. I'm pressing enter. Do I do I press it? Do I press it now? Okay, I did that. Okay. Oh, it didn't work. Um. Mmm. Press the switch again. It's not working. It's something wrong? Let me try. Oof, uff, uff. Oof, uff. Weird. Why has it stopped working? It seems to have stuck again. Have stuck again. 
We can't continue without activating this switch. Wait a little bit. Toya will try to do something. Okay. Whatever you're trying to do, it's definitely not working. Versus it's Spike standing in the way. This switch doesn't even work. Are you okay there? Toya presses the switch non-stop. The look, the lack of any reaction is starting to annoy her. Are you okay there? Is it even supposed to work? Oh, now it's down. Okay, well, Toya, I'm, a, I'm about to leave you. Go, go, okay. Ah, you stupid piece of metal. Work, damn you. Oh, wait, where is the child? She's about to kill me. Ah, child, you are here. I mean, you are here. You, you, here you are. <laughs> I can't read the last. Okay, anyway, don't wander off like this again. All right, it can, it can be dangerous here. You don't want to make aunt Toya sad, do you? When did you became my aunt? This room is useless now. But before you, child, there were a lot of humans. There were. I taught them the rules of fighting here. And this dummy. Ah, so many memories. A monster used to live in the ruins too. Not all of them were friendly, but we managed to co co sexist <laughs> very well such a pity that these times have long since long since passed okay oh no time for nostalgia ah I'm sorry Toya is such a chatterbox talking about chatter see that dummy I often talk to her when I'm bored or uh, have nothing to do I've noticed you are not very talk talkative yourself. Maybe you could try talking to the to dummy. Huh? Um? Don't look at me like that. Dummies are not scary to talk to. They may they may not be able to answer, but they are good listeners. Who knows? Anyway. <laughs> Something suspicious is going on with Toyo. Dummy stands still in front of me. You hesitate to strike. Well, I do not like this at all. The dummy's eyes are pinned onto you. Seems like the dummy is scared. I can't talk. Okay, okay, okay. Tension. Um, act, dummy, check, zero, zero, main, main G piece of trash. I do not like the wind in the background. Pun, it has become rather tense. So you decided to tell the only pun you know. No reaction. You feel even more stupid than before. Talk. It seems incredibly stupid to you. You hesitate yet tim timidly say hi. He says nothing back. Toya was very happy. There is a reassuring smile on her face. It seems she waits for you to the continue to continue the dialogue. Okay. Spare. You can't even spare the dummies. Three. Oh, you ran away? Sorry, it was foolish of me to make you talk to him. But it's alright, Toyo is always there for, for you. Don't be shy, come to me anytime. I'll tell you everything you want to know. Okay. Sure. There is only one puzzle in this room. I wonder if you can solve it. Hee <laughs> hee. I can solve anything, bitch. Oh, my bad, my bad. 
Yep, your mama, mama goat, mama toyo. I can't say those words to you. The western room is the eastern part, eastern room's blueprint. Okay. Okay, here we go. Yeah, you gonna get it in front of me? So this is the puzzle, but here, take my hand for a minute. He's about to throw me off but to the spikes. The sharp spikes hide under the floor as Toya walks, walks across the right steps. Toya must already know the solution to the puzzle. It's all good. Yet, one odd step and you dead. You dead, son. Your grip, grip on Toya's hand becomes harder. This puzzle must be too difficult for you. Don't walk here alone, alright? Gonna go back. It's dangerous around here. Toyo has forbidden to walk here. It's not like you wanted to anyway. You right? I had one task in store for you, but why not we unwind a little bit? Let's rest from all this heat. It's a long way, so take my hand. Uh, that will make me feel better. He's about to kill me. Oh, big, big goat and paw slightly presses your hand. Toya doesn't seem a stranger to you anymore. You feel an uh, oh oh. An era of safety around Toriel. You pluck up your courage to ask her about her life? Want to learn something about me? It's not like I have much to tell. I'm just a silly old lady who loves children. And I don't like to boast, but I'm the only monster in the ruins who makes great pies. I remember that I once won the family monster monster pie competition. I can still feel its taste. I put a figure of a little monster on that that pie. It had white fur and cute long ears. It seemed so tiny and even reminded me of an angel in the way. Ah, this pie was one of a kind. I'll treat you to it sometime, my dear. Drooling already? Hee <laughs> hee. Look, what do you like more, cinnamon or butterscotch? Hmm? Both? Perfect. Thanks for the information. I remember that. Okay. When, when do the scaries come in? Here we are. You seem to look better, child. It seems that the puzzles amused you too. Hee <laughs> hee. They always make a good job of it. Let's go. There are more puzzles to solve. Sure. Just a regular old pillar. Sure. It is. Can we go back? We can't. Ah, uh, but I don't want to. Um, here we go. Oh, this path is blocked. The wounds are in a worse state than you had expected. The wind is playing with your hair as if it were a pile of leaves on the ground. It's so hollow and lifeless here. It fills you with fear a little. Okay. Child, I've been thinking. You were so dark, dark, Ayo, this whole time. It's time to reward you. Oh, what do I get? Want a warm hug with the Aunt Toya? Yes, I do. And you lied to me. I should. Okay, we're not gonna do that to her. Well, how about I have to go back? Okay, nothing. 
Well done, Eliza. Come here. See, I didn't lie to you. Did that offend you, child? It did. It was just a test of trust. But you lied. <laughs> I'm sorry I had to use this trick. The giant pile of leaves down there was meant to soften your fall. Thanks for trusting me, my child. Sure. Sure. Okay. Let's keep going. This one is very simple. I think you're a smart girl and you'll solve it without my help. My child, look at how slowly it moves. It must be very difficult for it. Be a good girl and, and help it. My child, you have to move the stone forward, not backwards. Don't you want to help it solve the puzzle with us? Not really. Ha, ah, golly. You're so pleased, Eliza. <laughs> you have something in mind for that stone, don't you? Want to tell me where you are moving it to? Mm hmm? Let me think. To a better world? I do. Let me take it with me. Alright, enough. <laughs> Can't say that word. I don't know how to say it. Around. Oh, oh, okay, Toya, you're gonna take matters in your own hands? You can go now, child. No, uh, I'm taking this rock with me. And on the road to the better world. You might be right. You know what, Toya? I don't need you. I was gonna have fun, but you're not allowing, allowing me to have fun. I'm just gonna leave you. No! My child, please, close your eyes. Oh, she's about to do something. Do not peek. Oh, she's about to do something to me. And she left. Okay, here we go. My child, Toya will be very glad if you use this tip. The leaves will point the way okay okay there we go not that bad okay I messed that up for some reason I'm stupid stupid motherfucker a, a stupid man Okay, that whole didn't make sense because it was on the leaves, but alright. Done so soon, Eliza? Here's a small reward. I have a few on me. You get a butterscotch candy. Why not please yourself with some sweet treat? Let's get started with this puzzle. You know what? Since you did the other I'm gonna I'm just gonna go. I can't interact with it, dang it. <laughs> I'm taking this rock with me. I can't do that. Oh, they know. They know I was gonna do that. Okay, anyway, let's just do this. Enough fooling around. <sighs> okay. Ta da! Together we can do anything. Can we? Can I move the rock? Nope. Okay, here we go. Oh, this. No, no! My child, don't touch that filth. Don't even... I don't even know how long it has been there. We will need to get rid of it. Let's get out of here and quickly. Why? Tell me, tell me these things, tell you. Oh, what was that? Didn't look a little spin there? I don't know if we can do that again. This is what N Nasta Block is. Right on the... I like hiding... Oh. Nasta Block, come out. Yes, that's you. Come out. Come on, go. Oh. Wait. wait.
Did she just kill Nasta Block, the ghost? Toyo, why would you do that? Why, why would you kill the ghost that had, uh, I forgot, dang it. That was like one of my favorite characters. You just killed him. Flowery was right about you. You're, you're, you're a psycho. Trying to kill everybody. Nice. She, she's gonna kill me. How could you kill Nasta Block? Eliza, have I scared you again? You sure did. Oh, oh. You say silly? It was just. Well, never mind. Ain't nobody. There we go. In the game, Nasta Block was like defined as, defined as a. I think a nobody, I think. Like, had no feelings or something. I forgot the game. It's been, it's been a long time. Ain't nobody. Just a parasite. Don't pay any attention to it. Everybody's alright. Everything's alright. Oh, look at that. Smile on her face. She's happy that she killed it. The ghost. I'm, about, I'm gonna get revenge on you, Toyo. You don't know what's gonna come to you. Oh yeah, Q keys. Oh, oh keys. It's all right. It's all right. That's the block. It's all right. It's all right. Let's go over here. My child. This room is dark and covered with spider webs. Are you sure you want to go there? Very well then. Be careful. Whoa. This is where the bakery cell was at. I think and there's no spiders the sign is wrapped in web supply door bake cell the finger you followed the text was stuck to the plate ah uh, huh no bakery here okay that's crazy you you kill you kill nasty block and it's creepy over there man everything is changing what are you gonna tell me, sign? Did you miss it? Wait, no, I did not miss it. Th that's the same. Eliza, I have to leave you for a short while. You all have to stay alone a little bit. I'm really sorry. Can you get past the ones on your own? No? I shouldn't put you to such danger. Um, could you wait in this room for a little bit? A little while? It won't take long. Be a good girl, won't you? It's reading it like a robot. You decided to wait until Toria comes. You are a good girl, right? But it's just, it's, it's just so boring to stand in one place. So you decide to sit. Oh. Sitting on the cold floor is... Still better than, better than getting into trouble because of your own carelessness. Or something even worse. Even a blind would, blind would pass through these traps though. But not you, a stupid clumsy girl. Too scared to talk to anybody? But, huh? Damn you all, damn you all idiots. Hatred towards your friends has filled with your head? Not a question mark? Had you, had you been braver, you would have started twirling, shaking the walls of the ruins. Traitors, I hate you. For some reason, these dumb heads had made you climb this cursed, cursed mountain. Why? 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 Why did you agree? Why did you go with them? Oh, that doesn't matter anymore. You're left to def to be filled with hatred and complete silence. Quiet girl is a good girl. That's what your moms used to say. Is everything I don't say is true? You wonder? Man, this is some game. Your thoughts are interrupted by a loud sound of a dying whale. Ah, that's just your belly. It's, it's a gold des desperate 
to feel the cold emptiness of your stomach. You feel as if the hunger was has created a giant hole inside of you. Let's continue. You've been sitting here for a long time. Your grim thoughts push you deeper and deeper into the abyss of despair, which brings terror. Yet, despite everything, you decide to keep going. There is just one switch. Okay. Uh, if I remembered, it was here? No, it's over there. Wait, what? Uh, was I stupid? Let me see. Uh, blind. I'm blind. Blind over here. But what, what, what? There's a kitten over there. What is this? Mr. Midnight. Mr. Midnight. Okay. Here we go. Do we have to do this? I really don't want to do this. The far door is not an exit, it simply works in the Okay. Okay, okay. Are these broken too? I think they're broken. Oh no. If you can read this, press the blue switch. Blue, 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 what is you? It's that one. Okay. Yes, press it, press it, press it now. Okay, here we go. Move out of the way, switch. Move, move. Press the red switch. Red, red, red. There we go. Let's keep moving. Huh? You hear a strange sound. Seems like someone's screaming. Someone's crying for help? Looks like it's coming further from the ruins. It could be Toriel screaming, or Toriel is killing someone. If you can read this, press the green button. Is this green? Why? Why does that look green to me? I'm I'm fucking fucking colorblind. It would make sense. Or did I do that on purpose? Oh, an accident. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Okay, here we go. It's over here. Oof, 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 oof. And the balcony opens a <coughs> picture something view on the ruins and it's empty lab labyrinth labyrinth the wind is howling through the building rising the dust so lonesome wouldn't you want to get stuck in there okay here we go here we go here we go I gotta visit her. What if something happened? Wait, who do you kill, Terry Toyo? I heard someone scream. My child, what are you doing here? Have I not told you to wait for me in that room? What if something were to happen to you? You can't be so reckless. Ah, I must have been away for too long. So long you've grown tired of waiting. Forgive me for this. Not a scratch. Perfect. Don't just stand here. Come on in. Just come on in. Okay, we go. Compared to the rest of your surroundings, this little house looks really comfy. Yet, deep inside, you have a feeling something bad is about to happen. Deep inside, you're filled with fear. Because you're scared of Toya, that's gonna, she's gonna kill you. Welcome to Toya's home, child. I didn't expect any guests, so this place may be a bit <clears throat> messy. 
There are probably some things laying around and some dusty corners. You aren't allergic to dust, are you? Good, good. Toyo is going to throw thoroughly that would clean the house. I want to think that you can have some real nice time here. Come now, I want to show you something. Oh boy. Okay, show me whatever you're gonna show me. Here it is. Your own room. It's a little bit gloomy, but I hope you feel like it. You will like it. Oh, you're, you're patting me on the head. Ah, and here is a humble present to you. Oh, a bow. Ah, you're such a cutie with this bow. I'm glad to have found it. Another child forgot it here a long time ago. Unfortunately, she wasn't so well behaved. So I ate it like a little push, <laughs> pushy and naughty girl. I'm sure you would understand. It's hard to get along with such people. But I believe humans can change over time. Don't you agree with me? Sure! Ah, now you are a well behaved little girl. Well behaved little girl. What a relief. It's a, it's such a pleasure to be around such children. Well, this room is at your disposal. You have better look around for now. My modest library holds a lot of interesting books. Don't be shy to take them. Be, feel yourself at home, dear. Dear. Oh, I do not like this at all. You take a peek inside the closet, all shelves are stuffed with different clo looking clothing. Some of which don't fit you because many children have died here. A push toy, it's lost, it's color. It kind of reminds you of Toy I catch an empty sheet of paper is glued to the wall. Yep, we already read that. The lab doesn't work. Okay. Um, there's something collecting dust in the box. Ah, that's toys. We don't want to touch them. Not in the slightest. Um, one of the items, however, picks your interest. You got a box of crayons. One of them looks bitten. Okay. Um, you... Who could have thought to put a water sausage in a flower vase? Nothing. How about this? It's Eliza. Okay. They just keep going. Okay. I'm guessing Toyo's over here. Oh, she's not. Big and comfy. The flowers are dead. Flowers are dead. The door is locked. You feel a nice scent coming from the kitchen. There is a fire in the fireplace which makes the air around it noticeably warmer. Feels nice. You decide to warm up for a while. Suddenly you remember about the fudge Toyo gave you. It's very stern. Yet you can try to melt it. Melt it? Yes. You unwrap the tree and hold it before the fire. Surprisingly, the fire doesn't feel hot. It wraps around your hands gently. Finally, the fudge melts and you eat it. Yummy. Okay. Lots of books. You take a run the book. Uh, 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 no. Do I have to say yes? I'm not about to read this. I don't care about. Yes, that's nice. That's nice. Yes, that is nice.
Oh, there she is. Okay, we go. Ah, child. Child. You, here you are. The pie is ready. You like this book? What a coincidence. Me too. Hmm. I have an idea. What's your idea? Oh, that, that is a cute. You and Toyo discuss different topics long into the night. Um, as if you were old friends, even a boring psychopedia about snails can turn out to be interesting given you have someone to talk to. Sweet butterscotch cinnamon crust is crisping pleasantly inside your mouth. Delicious, so delicious. Ever, ever so kind and caring monster. I since no, I was to say sincerely, suddenly come to your liking. Her happy, happily shining eyes and cheerful voice have made your you your <laughs> fat fat you fat fat that word wither away. Friendly chatter paired with a sweet treat fills your heart with joy. Isn't it perfect? And start someone until someone is dying. Ah, child, wait. I'll be right back. Oh, that's me. Dying. Because Toyo is out for me. Trying to, trying to kill me. She made me sick. Hold up, hold up. This thing just popped up. Okay, here we go. Here you, here, here. Deep breath. Oh, I'm so sorry. I have forgotten how most of food can affect humans. Wow, you forgot that? It's n nothing. We are, we are gonna fix it. Fix this. There, there. Man, she's gonna kill me like this. Sick. Oh dear. I cannot let you travel home in such a state. You look so bad. Thank you for hurting my feelings, dear. You will rest here until you have recovered your strength. So. So unfortunate. Stay put. I shall fetch some medicine from my garden. And this is how I die. Toyo has taken me. Wait, is that it? Please don't be it. Oh my goodness, why? Well, that was amazing. I really, really enjoyed it. If, uh, if Undertale was like a horror game, it would be this. It would be this. Like, there is a lot of Undertale fan games. Like, a lot. A lot of them. And, uh, this one is special. Special, special. It's like recreating the whole game, but like, horror tale. Ho yeah, horror tale. Like, in scary. Scary, scary. And of course to you dear play thank you hope you hope you make a second chapter two hope you make chapter two what else horror tale chapter one what and it closed the game <laughs> so yeah i think that is it thank you for watching hope you enjoyed um Hope they make chapter two, like I said, because I'm really looking forward um to uh playing chapter two because like uh, it's it's just it's just good. I can't I don't have any words to explain it. So yeah, hope you enjoy. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.